1978. It is uh, very crazed, but um, I like the colors. It's very 70, very vintage. That's an owl. Is an owl sitting on a bell? Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a... Colleen here from Fish Chick Finds. I'm here with another haul video. Um, this is haul number 44 um, and it's from a couple different places. So um, yeah, welcome back um, to my friends. And um, if you're not subscribed yet and this is your first time here, welcome and um, please consider doing so. I would love to have you as part of the Fish Chick fam. So without further ado, let's do. So, last weekend I wasn't able to source. It's okay, I have a lot of stuff to list, believe me. Um, I went out of town to um, a wedding. It was my, my dear friend, Pam, her son got married. So, um, another friend that lives in the area here, we drove down to um, her location and we went to the wedding. It was wonderful. I'll put a picture of us right here. Uh, maybe if I can get a couple pictures from the wedding, I'll post those um, as well. It was beautiful there. It, by far was the best wedding I've been to uh, in a number of years. Um, so um, yeah, while I was down there um, and on the way home, um, we stopped for breakfast and much to my surprise, right across the street was a Goodwill and I went, oh, how convenient is this? So um, Nicole is the one that I drove down there with. Um, Nicole and I went to Goodwill and this is what we got. Before I begin, Mr. Fisher is with me today. Hello, folks. Hi. I'm looking, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing this stuff. I really haven't seen this yet. Okay. So, I'm excited. Okay. So that this is, the first one is the Goodwill from last weekend. Goodwill. In Port Charlotte. Port Charlotte. Okay, and I spent fifty-five dollars here. So, um, all right. So um, one of the first things I picked up, and I don't know much about this. Um, I don't think it's painted. I think it's an applied, um, um, uh, applied. This part is applied right here. Um, it's just a little white ginger jar, but I really like the colors, and um, I really like birds. So um, I thought that was really pretty. Yeah. So do do do, little ginger jar. Looks so, cute. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I like the macaws on there. They're, They're macaws. I mean, I'm yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm so generic. Um, when I talk, I'm like it's a bird. It's a bird. It's, it's There's no perfect. classification in in my book. It's just. Hmm. I am speaking generalizations yeah, most of the time. So that's a bird. They? No, they are not macaws. They're something else. Oh, they're not macaws. No. So they are. Hmm. Um, okay. Uh, next, I just, you know what? I feel it's, ignorant. <laughs> you're smarter than I am. All right. So um, the next thing I picked up was this dish. Now, I know it glows because I had one just like it, and it was green. Um, and it's supposed to go inside of a um, little... Um, silver piece with a handle. Um, I never found the silver piece uh, for the handle with the handle for the last um, piece that I picked up and this one didn't have it either but I knew exactly what it was. I didn't even look it over. I just grabbed it, put it in my cart and guess what? Well you can see it. There it is. There's a chip. Chip. Big chip. Big chip. Yep right there. Um, these are the colors in my room so I'm just going to put it on my dresser and we'll put like earrings and you know whatnots in there so um, keep it for myself. Don't care. No big deal. Okay, let's see. Next piece I picked up was this item right here. Um, it's a little um, carousel horse, you think? This is a stone, I'm not sure exactly what stone. Um, all, as always, having issues with the um, camera focusing. Hey, it looks like a piece of white marble. Yeah. Or so. Not a but. It is signed. Oh, it goes this way because you can see the signature. There does have some rust right here. I'm not sure if we can get that off or not. And there is some paint loss. Um, but I like these things. I, I, I like it when it shows some age a little bit. I don't think it's completely trash, but I think it's very cool. It has a sticker on the bottom still that Mr. Fisher will get off. Um, and it came with the tag that fell off in transit, but I thought that was pretty cool. It's a DeMott carousel horse. Decorative. So there's that piece. Marble. Think so? Yep. Okay. 
Um, the next two pieces, may I have that little silver tray over there? Silver tray, come yep. your way. This, this, this is not anything spectacular. Um, so uh, all it is really is, um, it, it will fit on the back of, um, it'll fit on the back of um, the toilet. Uh, and my, we had our um, second bathroom redone, guest bathroom redone last year. Um, so I still have to decorate it. I've just been too busy shopping. <laughs> um, so yeah, I just saw this and I was gonna, you know, put some little thingies on there, on the back of the toilet there. I'm not sure what we're putting on it, but this is also gonna go on there. And I bought this to go on the back of the toilet as well. Kids can put some, you know, cotton, um, cotton balls in it or something, some soaps or what have you. Um, so I thought these are two little pieces that I'm going to keep for myself for now, um, unless they don't fit where I'm thinking of putting them, and then they will be for sale um, in my eBay store. Um, so that's that one. Now this right here, I picked this up um, simply to decorate for Easter. And I started yesterday, but I didn't really finish. I don't really have a lot of time to decorate. Um, I also picked up another piece. It is a um, silver, uh, plated silver. I think it's more modern, uh, made to look vintage. Um, but it's just like a, a um, silver plated beaded platter cake stand. Um, and it's has a, um, it's footed. What do you call it? A pedestal. <laughs> That's what it's called. Um, so um, I, I put some Easter decorations on it. I'll take a picture and put it up here for you. Um, so this is just a um, hand painted, painted plate. And I just thought they were cute with daisies on them and Easter colors. And I was going to do like a little, you know, decoration. Um, don't know if I'll still get around to it. Still have a couple days anyway. Um, so just got this one. Um, it says on it, Carmen. I don't think it's anything special. But I kind of like it. I think it would look good with the Easter decorations on it. So there's that one. Flowers are nice on it. Yeah, I think I like it. So this one right here is an owl. It's an owl bell. It's a Nesco, uh, 1978. It is uh, very crazed, but um, I like the colors. It's very 70, very vintage. That's an owl. Is an owl sitting on a bell? Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a. It looks like a sleeveless dress. And the owl is. You see the waist? Yeah. And, yeah. So what's this supposed to be? The eyes. <laughs> I look the like feminine it. parts? Yes. Uh, and this is the waist? Yeah. It looks like a dress. <laughs> so what do you guys see? I see a hooter dress. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's what I see. It's, yeah. That's what you see. Yep. But it's a bell. It, it certainly is a bell. It's a bell, but it looks like a dress. It's the bell of the ball. <laughs> yes. I can see why she's the bell of the ball. Ah. Doesn't really ring too well. Good. It. Yeah. All right. Oh my God. Good Lord. <laughs> wow. All right. All right. That was fun. That was fun. Uh, let's move on. Let's move on. Yep. <laughs> no more okay. Food. I, okay, so these were half price. Um, so I got these. I really liked it. I liked the frames. Um, there are two uh, lithographs um, of um, Chowning's Tavern in Williamsburg, Virginia. And it says on here who... Who, it says who the artist is? Goff, yes. But it's really small, so I'm going to break up my eye. And we're going to see who... Clark Goff. 74. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, here's the other one. Yep, yeah, and there's this one. And here's the other one. And this one is, excuse me, Colonial Capital. And I think this one says 73. So. Yes, he did this one in 73. Clark M. Goff. So, and I, like I said, I really like the frames. This one's a little, but they're so nice. There's the back of them. Hang it up, frame center. Hang it up. Okay, so I got those for a very good price. Um, I'm still thinking about this thing. What do you guys think it is? What do you guys think it looks like? It's a dress. It's a bell. No, it's a dress. It's blue. No, it's green. 
It's a drill. It's a drill. <laughs> hooter dress. It's a hooter dress. Okay. All right. All right. So this. Now. I don't know. I thought this was um, a Hager vase, um, like a um, Art Deco revive, you know, revival piece from the '80s, and I still think it might be. I'm not exactly sure, um, but I I really liked it. So um, the only thing that threw me off is that it said it was made in Japan. Oh really? Yeah, because I thought right here this said this was like an old Hager pottery '80s sticker that had come off. But it's Japan? Yeah, it says made in Japan. Oh. Okay. I'm not a big fan of this, uh, not a big fan of this, right. this, I'm not a big fan of this camera. Camera? No. no not at all. All right, so there's that vase. You don't talk into it like this? <laughs> Luke. I am your father. <laughs> no, you are my husband. Yeah, that would be strange if I was your father. Yes. Because <laughs> I'm not. That's exactly right. All right, interesting. From Japan. Made in Japan. In Japan. <laughs> I th th the next thing I saw, and these were scattered throughout the store in different locations, so I picked them all up. But I, I don't know anything about these. I thought these were maybe just like a hobbyist piece. It says, um, with this crappy camera... It says Bartlett on the back, right up here. Do you see that? Yes, you can see that. Yes. Bartlett. This one says 2005. Um, so not quite vintage, but I like the pottery. It's really good quality. There is a plate. Then I found this bowl, Bartlett 2005. Same design. Same design. Then I found this pail, maybe? Basket. Basket, <laughs> pail, basket. Tomato, tomato. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but this one is Bartlett 99. Okay. So I have no idea what's going on with this stuff. I'll have to do some research. If anybody knows anything about Bartlett, um, you know, even if it, you know, Bartlett is your neighbor. Bartlett Tell him I said hi. I got your pail bucket. Are there Bartlett apples? Yeah, they're Bartlett apples. Those are apples. Yes. Apples. Um, okay, so that was um, everything from Goodwill. Oh, I did buy um, a pillow, too. It's out on the back porch. Um, a, a decoration. So, decorative pillow. Um, no need to see it. It's not for sale. It's not for, you know, it's not vintage. It's just, it was there. It was nice. I liked it. Um, okay. So let's move on to um, the second part of Hall 44, which was purchased yesterday, which, okay. It was purchased this past Saturday, because today's Sunday. I'm sitting around in my ponytail and my, my sweats. <laughs> anyway, um, uno momento, por favor. Uh, si? <laughs> yeah, okay. So um, on the way home, I said, no sourcing this weekend. I got so much stuff to take pictures of and list, which actually everything's all ready to list. I just was waiting on the pictures. It's just a matter of just dropping them in and, and listing them. So I'll show you my listing, um, my listing method at some point. I'll post a video up. It um, goes really quick after I do all the initial stuff, but I just have to get that you know, piece done. That's really aggravating. <laughs> um, research, love, listing, love. It's that stuff in between, getting it prepped and all that fun stuff. So, wasn't gonna go sourcing. Saw that my um, one of my favorite um, estate sale companies in the area was um, hosting their second day um, sale, probably about three miles from my house. So I was like, hmm, I'm already out. So let's go. So uh, I went and um, I spent twenty nine dollars and three cents there. So these are the items that I picked up. Okay, so this one right here, little rusty and crusty tin. You see the rusty? Yep, crusty. Um, I love it. I love the colors in it. Um, I just thought it was very cool. It's got the flowers on the side. I, I just, I like the colors. like everything about it. It is Huntley and Palmer's Biscuits, Reading in London, England. 
Come in. Okay. Reading. Reading. Not reading. Reading in London. Reading. Okay. I was reading. I'm, I'm pretty sure anyway. I don't know. It's, called, it's pronounced Reading here in the States, so. I was reading in London. <laughs> came, up, came, up, came upon this tin. Okay. Oh, God. We get like punch, punch, punch drunk on, on Sundays because we're like, ugh. Spent? <laughs> we're tired and don't want to go to work the next day. I got me a Virgin Mary. Right here. I got me a Velvet Jesus. Velvet Jesus. Yeah, I just posted him. He's listed in eBay now, so we'll see what happens with him. I know some of you are wondering what's going to happen with Velvet Jesus being so close to his seasoning. Yes. Okay. All right. Maybe he can uh, rise up and be on your wall. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Next. All right. So next, uh, you know, these were just sitting around. They tossed them in for free. I was talking to another reseller friend of mine who happens to be in the same business I am, not the reselling business, my other business. Um, and she was like, oh, pick this stuff up. I don't do music, but I love music. And uh, they were free, so I just got these tapes. Yeah, K Kid. Oh, yeah, Kid K. Technotronic. Yeah, Kid K. <laughs> That's what us old folks say. Um, what was their big hit? What was it? Pump up the jam. Pump, pump up the, the jam. jam. Pump, pump it, it up. Do your feet a thumping. Pump it, pump it, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> He's just making stuff up now. No, <laughs> it, it definitely isn't. Everybody dance now. You know. <laughs> Sorry. I'll have to edit the volume on that one. Yeah. Well, I can't hit that. Hey, note. A for a, a for effort, man. I can't I hit mean, that note unless I scream it. Oh, okay. So. Well, you hit it, so you know. <laughs> Sorry. I just put a little forewarning before he starts it. Yeah. Like, get your <laughs> earplugs ear out. In. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. It's all right. I liked it. I, I actually had to play that song one time with Dave, and I, and uh, I had to do that part. So <laughs> it was funny. If you don't know, um, Tim is a musician, uh, currently kind of on hiatus, trying to step back for a little while. He's kind of like a, at that been there, done that type stage in his life as far as music goes. So he's feeling like maybe once he retires, he'll, you know, he'll, he'll, he'll get back into it a little bit just for fun. But I'm enjoying the weekends off. Exactly. Wonderful. He's enjoying <laughs> helping me run my business on the weekends now because I used to go and support him, so now he's supporting me. Yes. Mm-hmm. That got old after a while. I was like, I'm too old for this. Can't be out till 2 a.m. <laughs> Good Lord. Who does that? I mean, oh. at my age. I mean, I know that, I know y'all are out there somewhere doing it. Not me. Um, okay. Lisa Stanisfield. Just got another cassette tape. I'm just going to put these at a lot. I don't care. Um, Lisa Stanisfield. What, is she, what, is she, what does she sing? I have no idea. She sings this song. Yeah. And it was written by Barry White. You'll never find You'll never find. Oh, that's not, no, that's not it. That's Lou oh, no. Rawls. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Lou Rawls? That's not Lou Rawls. Yes. Barry White is, uh... <laughs> Don't you're sing. You're my everything. <laughs> oh, baby. Okay. It's like living with a jukebox. <laughs> ching Oh. Okay. The KLF. I don't remember what they sing. They had a hit in the early Oh, East. KLF. Yeah. Um, oh, because we, I mean, we should have that DJ company, too. Yeah, we own a DJ business. You all know that. I'll put it up here. Five things you don't know about me. There's one less. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> we used to own a DJ business. Wiki, wiki. Okay, so I'm just going to put these up. I don't know. Probably like 12 bucks, $4 each. Put them as come to me. Put them as a lot. Oh, it'll come to you. Yeah, it'll As come he Googles to on his phone. Yeah. <laughs> it comes to me as I Google it. <laughs> Everything comes to those who Google. Yes. <laughs> okay. Next. Um, daughter says she wants old frames to hang some stuff up in her room. Pick this one up. I thought it fit the bill. It's a nice old frame. Little legs. It's got no thing on the back, but I have enough of them hanging around. I'll just pop one on there. So, yep. Just a silver plated frame. Nothing special. I got that one. Here you go. Yes. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Let's see what else. Okay. So I picked these up and I said to the owner, Valerie, 
come here asking $20 for these? She goes, because I couldn't find them anywhere. I said, well, touche, my friend. That's what I do, too. Okay. So here they are. I'll look them up. They're shoes, right? Shoes. They're ashtray shoes. Okay. Right? There's a little ashtray thing in there. They say this on the back. Which, what did we say this this said? Oh, it had something about... This, this... It had something about the fire of your ashes need to be dumped here okay. or something like that. Yeah, yeah it was... Dispose of your... Yeah. Okay, so one has a smoking donkey and one has a smoking pig. Smoked pork. Smoked pork. <laughs> And smoked. Those are cool, though. Okay. Can't say that word. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So I got those, too. I thought they were pretty cool, right? So, um, you know, Valor, if you're watching, if I find out anything about them, I will let you know. Um, I, I looked real quickly last night. Couldn't find a darn thing. If any of you out there happen to know what they are, please feel free to inform us. Thank you. Okay. Music. Back to music. Not going to get any money for this. It was free. Pearl. And why? Because, you know, like, we're always singing in our videos. We're always talking about music. We had a question of the day for a little while. Um, and uh, this was a, a cool little Legacy Edition uh, CD. Janis, Janis Joplin. Joplin. Yeah. yeah, nice. Yeah, give me a little piece of your heart, baby, or something. Go on and take it. Take, take it. Take little piece of my heart now, baby. Whatever. Intermission time with Tim. <laughs> Don't get me started. <laughs> exactly. Don't, did, don't get him yeah, started. Yeah. Don't even ah. get him started. <laughs> okay. Um, silhouette picture. Love these. I think they need to bring them back. It's, uh, you know, you're seeing all my other. Okay. You've seen it. it. You don't need to see the reflection of everything in the background. So there it is. Very cool. Cool frame. Cool frame. Cool picture. I love it. Um, don't know how old it is, but um, I just really like it. I really like it. Um, I never buy decorator plates. In case you didn't hear me. Never. I don't normally buy <laughs> decorator plates. But what did I buy? Decorator plates. And why? Because they're pretty. Fairies. They're fairies. Fairy. Very nice. <laughs> These are very nice. <laughs> This one is, they're, they're all by Heinrich, Germany, Villeroy and Bach. Okay. Love these. I, I just love them. Little fairies. They're all ready to be hung on your wall um, as accent pieces or what have you. This is the only one that's this style. Let me show you the other ones. Same company. I love them. Oh, tell me that isn't adorable. Okay, go ahead. If you must, just put it in the comments. It's not adorable. It's adorable. Okay, go ahead. Do. Oh, I matched my glasses. Okay, here you go. Here's another one. This one is Fairies of the Fields and Flowers. Oh, who's the artist? By Cecily Mary Barber. Bar Barber? Barker? I don't know. I don't know what this one's called. Oh, this is um, Elderberry. Elderberry Fairy. Elderberry. Very so pretty. I love the colors, everything. Here you go. And this one's pretty spring colors as well. This one's called Ragged Robin. They have a friend named Robin. She was over here last night. I don't even think she realized that this was named Ragged Robin. So there's that one. Ragged so, Robin. <laughs> Ragged Robin. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. We are never, ever, ever going to get. Um, <laughs> Get a copyright strike with no, sorry, not with me. With our covers. <laughs> Did I tell you how much I spent here? Did I tell them how much I spent here? It was twenty nine something. Yep. Right? Okay. Just checking. All right. This I just saw and it was super cute and I'm gonna send it off to um, send it off to another reseller friend. Um, cause it's fitting. I'll just say that. It's just so tiny. I love smalls. Tiny dolphin. Can you? Are you gonna sing Tiny Dolphin too? Oh, I almost did. <laughs> you know me so well. Oh yeah. Okay. I won't. Little tiny dolphin. It's only going a few counties up in here in Florida. Okay. Um. Let's see. So, 
These, I really like these. I've had made in Italy frames before, sold quickly. Um, it had the black flowers in it. It was Victorian looking, gorgeous. Um, these are different, but it they, they're smaller and there is a set of four and they are made in Italy um, and they are silk. So there's this one. And you know what? My friend Rachel from Manor House Vintage, I'm pretty sure she just posted the same exact frame with a picture, an older picture in it, some uh, ephemera. Just, I almost said that again, S with some old um, ephemera in it. So there's that one. There's four of them. Um, Those are really neat. They are very neat. And it's this one. satin? Yep, it's satin. Oh, or, wow. No, silk. Oh, silk, silk. These silk. are silk. Did I say satin? No, I said satin. Okay, I probably said satin silk. too. Who knows? Is that what I meant? One of them is ripped. I'm going to leave it like that because I'm afraid if I try to fix it, um, I'll just do more damage because I'm not a fixer of things. Let's see, right here. Yeah, it's got a frayed edge. It's afraid. Ah! Okay. <laughs> we are boldly going where no one has gone before. <laughs> okay. Then I bought this 1951 yearbook. It is from my home state of Massachusetts, but it is from the other end of the state. It is from Waltham, Massachusetts. 1951. This is the mirror. Yeah, it's got some autographs in it and stuff. I just thought it was very cool. Education, freedom, equality, and the right to participate in a free world. The Mirror, Volume 3, Number 2. Published by the students of the Waltham High School. Class of 1951. Yeah. Wow, That's so cool. they would be 89 now? Look at yes, 89. F. Beer did this drawing. In our class... F. Um, Beer. <laughs> in, in our class, we had an artist in our class that did our designs for us. Um, for our yearbook, the faculty... Oh, look, he drew all of these. He drew this, too. Faculty. That's pretty cool. They have the students' artwork in there. Um, aww. They had... Uh, it almost has, like... Look at that page. It almost looks has, a, like, a Doonesbury feel to it. You know? Well, I'm 51, right? Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Maybe it was the guy who The seniors. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a class will, a poem. We'll see um, a few of these. Wow. Well, it wasn't a Catholic school for sure because they don't have that thing that all the people in the Catholic schools used to wear, that like black thing. Everyone had the same black little draped over thing on them. So girls got to wear what they wanted to wear. Isn't that nice? Hmm. All right, what else do we have here? Anything else interesting in here? There There's are a, just a bunch of uh, memos on the back page of whoever. Yeah, yeah. Whoever I mean, it was. you know. It's like yeah. Crazy. They, yeah, you know, when everyone signs your yearbook, when you get your yearbook. But look at this. Look at Pauline. Pauline, what a rebel, Pauline. She wrote. She wrote upside down. What is she writing? Muscles. Muscles. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that would probably be fitting of something like a Popeye phrase, like, hey, your muscles, or whatever. Yeah, who, knows? <laughs> who knows? But there's all these. Yeah, crazy. Frank, I don't know, I can't read half of these. And some dude with the John Hancock little squish and two lines underneath. Yeah, uh, some over <laughs> here. Um, oh, woo! He wrote, this person wrote... Liz something is a S blank blank Y bag bag hmm sexy bag sexy bag I don't know is that what you're thinking I don't know that's like an oxymoron if you ask me yeah. <laughs> um, is that, oh no the last thing right over here did you grab uh, sexy bag yeah oh I got this is. too and I used this last night I got this for myself Little wick trimmers. No. Oh, I'm not going there. No. <laughs> I brought these home. Tim's like, what? What are those? Keep it away. They're for candles. Uh, they got it for candles. Oh my god. <laughs> May I have that last thing right there? Oh, this. Yeah. Hey, okay, there it is. This is a vintage umbrella that Mr. Fisher. You still have to take the tag off of this. 
Okay, Oops. now you only have half a tag. It is a Knurps. Knurps. Or if you asked him, oh, it's Knurps. I was like looking at that just now. Knurps. Yeah. I said, honey. You know, because. You why know. don't you go get me the knife and yeah. then rethink how we say this, okay? <laughs> huh, my left. My left, my left knee's a little sore. Oh my god! <laughs> Can dig it. Okay, so it zips open. It's got this little black patent leather pouch. I'm not opening it inside because it's bad luck. Did you did you know that? You probably did, but I will tell you again. It is bad luck to open an umbrella inside. I opened it outside yesterday and it does work and it is simply beautiful. There is um, some fading on it. It's a beautiful color. Um, there is some fading on it. All of the um, uh, arms seem to be working and uh, it's like, it must be like the first automatic thing before the totes thing came along, but it's got the little button here for it to pop up and it's, it's, it's a stunner. I really like it. And uh, it's going to be coming soon to an eBay store near you. Which, by the way, is in um, is down in my description. And um, if you follow my link tree, my link tree links, it'll take you to the link for my eBay store. So this is a vintage NURPS. And I'm probably even saying it wrong. Um, no, it's got to be NURPS. Um, umbrella. In a case. So cool. I love it. It is nice. All right, so that is all for haul 44. So we say that is all for my haul. So uh, I want to thank you all for watching. What was your favorite thing? What was my favorite thing? Yes, sir. Oh, it's got to be this. The hooter dress. <laughs> the hooter dress. Bell of the, the ball. Bell, bell of the ball. <laughs> the bell of the ball hooter dress. I'm sorry. You're sorry. welcome. <laughs> I'm sure exactly what they were thinking. Ooh. Okay. All right. So thank you so much for joining me. And uh, we hope to see you soon. If you could, please like, comment, and share. That would be awesome. Um, and if you're enjoying the video, tell some friends. That's what sharing means. Um, and, uh, yep, that's all I have. So thanks so much for watching, friends. I really appreciate you. Bye. Waka, 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 waka.